Hi, I'm Drew, Application Engineer with SKF. This video will show you how to run a test with your AWA. All right, so we're going to press the OK button to continue. And then we're going to get a safety screen that uh, ensures we have a high voltage leads attached, which we do. And to start the test, we're going to press the Megum and Lead 3 buttons simultaneously to initiate the test. And so it's going to proceed through the, the test order. In this case, it's uh, doing a mega test up to 500 volts. We see the higher charging current, which was 3.5 microamps. Now the current is scaling down to measure more accurately the small leakage current, which in this case is 0.02. And as we hold the voltage, uh, that current will decay away over time. Uh, you can always see which act test is active here by the blinky light or the, the blinking on light. And you can see here that we're testing. Uh, the leads energized light indicates that the high voltage leads are energized during this portion of the testing. So the timer uh, started uh, when we achieved test voltage. Uh, once the one minute timer times out, based on the time set here, it will proceed to the next test, which is the DA in this case, dielectric absorption test. And this screen will display calculated megohms and leakage current. Uh, with respect to time on a graph, the live voltage and current values and calculated resistance values are in the lower right hand corner, and then our time remaining indicator. All right, so now we've moved on to the, the step voltage test. Um, and uh, we can see uh, the, the grid will populate with the uh, leakage current and calculated megaohms as we proceed through each step. Uh, we can click on the levels screen to see the voltage level and leakage current that we're presently at. You also see the voltage level and the leakage current here in the lower right hand corner. The graph is displaying voltage um, level, which is the blue line, and then leakage current, which is the red line here for each step. So Let me see the charging current level. I'd like to show that to you. It's higher. <laughs> it barely got there before it came down. And then the grid being populated with the values here. And that will continue with each step as we proceed. 